Last quarterfinal, we've got our one seed against our seven seed. Talk to me about our number one seed. So the, the number one seed, um, they scored 248 last time out. They're not ranked high enough to advance right now. Uh, they got a lot of work to do. We saw a 300-point match bring down an average. They've got some work to do if they want to move on. And on the number seven seed, I, I think as well, scored 274. What do they need to do in the next match? They're Right now they're sitting at that number four spot. They're high enough to move on. They just need to repeat what they did last time, make sure they don't make any of the little mistakes, polish everything up, and just go out there and have a clean match. All right, looking forward to two more. One more incredible quarterfinal between two more incredible alliances here at the 2015 IRI. Let's send it back down to Tyler and Dan. All right, IRI. This is going to be our last quarterfinal match. We're going to find out who's moving in semis. We're going to take average of the two matches these teams have. And right now, you're looking over 270 just to get into the semis. Holy cow. And it's predicated because our number seven alliance right now has the fourth seed. So it's going to be up to them to shut out the number one alliance from getting back in. So it's going to be close. One quick last announcement as well, if you're interested, from Concessions Whole Pizzas are in clearance for $10. All our hot items are half off at the upstairs concession stand. The bottom stairs concession stand is closed. So half off at the upstairs concession stand. With that said, we have our number one and number seven alliances competing. Number one in red, number seven in blue. Number one alliance needs a big score to move on. Please welcome 1114 from St. Catharines, Ontario. It's Simbotics. Joining them, 3641. Out of South Lyon, Michigan, the Flying Toasters. Run it up, give it up for 1730. Out of Lee Summit, Missouri, Team Driven. How about our blue lights? Let's hear it for 5254. From Trumansburg, New York. Robot Raiders! Alliance Captains 1 and 79! Out of Riviera Beach, Florida, the Children of the Swamp! The great human player loader of 548! From Northville, Michigan, the Robo Stings! We have a green light. Hold up one moment. Drivers behind the line. Quarterfinal eight, ready. Three, two, one, rush. All right, here we go, Autonomous, our last quarterfinal here before we go to the semis. All four of the totes pulled over to their respective sides. Robo Stains grabbing two. Symbotics grabbing two as well for red. Team Driven for red with a stack of three totes. And three totes stacked for the blue side as well. So 20 to 20 in bonus points in Autonomous. And we enter into teleoperator mode in our last quarterfinal match of the day. Under two minutes remaining. Drivers have control of the robots. Everybody's moving. Putting together their stacks. Children of the Swamp, 179 for blue. Getting ready to deposit their first stack over on a blue scoring platform. Team Driven for red doing the same. And Team Driven gets it done first. Children of the Swamp right behind him though. Second one over on the red side by the Robo Stains. And a third one by their third partner, the Robot Raiders. We have three on the red side as well. Our number one seeded alliance in red had 248 in their first match, so they need a strong score to up that average to get over the hump. Our seven seeded alliance had a 274 in their first match. That was a little more solid. We'll see who advances to the semis when we get past this match. Under 50 seconds now, 48 remaining in the match. Four stacks and some miscellaneous spins over on the blue side. Five on the red side. 35 seconds remaining. 
teams working feverishly trying to copy the efficiency we saw in the last couple of matches. Let's see if they can do it. 20 seconds now remaining. Six stacks over on the blue side, one only with two bins on it. On the red side, though, we've got seven stacks. And another one about to be placed. Six seconds now remaining in the match. Four, three, two, one. So time expires in our last quarterfinal match. We've got five, nine stacks over on the red side. Seven stacks, one's the short stack, a two over on the blue side. Most of them have containers and noodles on top, not all of them. Referees busy tabulating these scores. Hold on to your seats and we'll find out who advances to the semis momentarily. They left points on the board, big time. Red reacted like they made it. Red reacted like they did it, like they moved on. I'm looking at you guys, right? We're having a conversation. We're having a conversation. Yeah. Okay. Start with that. Start with that question about about winning regionals, and I'll, I get to compliment everybody. Okay. Yeah, it'll go good after that. Okay. All right. And when do you think? Oh, are we last? Oh, you're last. Yeah. So we'll do we'll do the regional question and then the switch and the robot build paradigm. Um, yeah, that sounds good. And then college. Do whatever you want. All right, we got a score coming up. We got 342 points for the Red Alliance. Enough for them to advance to the semis. 236 for the Blue Alliance. That kicks them down. They will not advance. That 342 is our second high score. One point lower than the high of 343 we saw a couple matches ago. So we have four alliances advancing. 8, 3, 2, and 1. But how about a round of applause for our four quarterfinalists that did not advance. They were awesome. 13... Alliance number six, alliance number five, alliance number seven, and alliance number four. They were great, folks. Hold on to your seats. We got the semis coming up. Up to you, Colin and Danny. All right. The number one seed, they pull it off. They do what they need to do to move on. Tell me what you saw from the Red Alliance. Well, it really showed their character, showed their grace under pressure, and how they can step up in the big moments when they need it. Um, they did leave some points on the board. They didn't use the three yellow totes in a stack, um, but they scored all of their recycling containers, uh, and they were just really well polished in that match. So they put up a really high score, and they still have room to improve. They're moving on. 